met with the media outside the Rockies clubhouse. And the first question he was asked was about his emotions. Uh, it's, it's really hard. It's, it's hard as a player, you know. Uh, I've been here for 10 years. I know, I know all this guy, all the coaches. So, so you really uh, get like in a deep relationship with them. So it's really hard, but it, you know, that's part of baseball. I was ready for it. I was like, uh, whatever is happening, I had to keep moving forward. I had to do my thing wherever I go. At what point today did you know that you might be traded? Were you surprised that you went out there and pitched an inning today? Yeah, I was really surprised because, like, even before the game, I mean, everybody knew it, even me. I mean, they, I, I, did, I even, even uh, I wasn't sure if I was I had to stretch, warm up, and thing like that because I was like, I mean, everybody know, everybody. So I don't. Uh, when I got to the bullpen, I was like, I don't even know what I'm doing here, pitch, because uh, it was a sure thing that they knew. Did that make it distracting for you to go out on the hill knowing that you were going to be traded and try and get through that inning? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I, I didn't have my mind on baseball right there. I was like, uh, it's really hard, you know, it's really hard to get traded. Uh, and what can I say? I mean, when I got to the mound, the first thing, I, I couldn't even throw a strike because I, I didn't have my mind at all in the game. What are your thoughts now? You go to Cleveland, you're going to a contender, they're in the race for the postseason. Your thoughts about that? Well, it's going to be a fun, that's the fun part about like being traded to a team like that because uh, right now they're in a good position. They're fighting for the, uh, for the first uh, place. So uh, I'm just looking forward to get there and uh, trying to do anything uh, to help the team. When you, you come off the field, your, your teammates are giving you a hug, obviously an emotional moment for you. You've been a Rocky all along. That had to be difficult. Yeah, yeah, it was difficult. Like, uh, you know, like, like I told you before, you got, uh, you had like all kind of relationship with those guys. Like, uh, with different, with all, uh, all those guys, you had like different kind of relationship. Like, uh, some, some of them you even had like uh, deeper relationship. Like, so it's really hard. It's, uh, it's not easy uh, to get traded, but like, you know, that's part of baseball. You have to, and um, that's part of life. There were reports in New York that you were frustrated that you didn't get a contract in the offseason that maybe some of your relationships had soured here. Is any of that true? No, I don't, I don't think it's true. I don't, I don't, I don't even know where they get that thing. I mean, everybody who knows me uh, know that I come to the stadium to work hard every day. And even if you feel something like that, you as a player, you just want to you wanna go out there and try to compete and show everybody what you're capable of doing. I mean, even if you're mad, if you, even if that, that, that is true, you don't, you don't want to look bad, you know? You want to keep doing your thing. Is there anything left you want to say to the Rockies fans before you depart for Cleveland? Sure, I mean, uh, I appreciate like, all you guys for giving me, uh, for all this year that you guys gave me your support. And I love you all, so bye. Okay. All right, thank you, Baldo. One quick question.